Hello everyone! Today we will have a new lesson about parts and functions of Microsoft Word. Microsoft Word is one of the most popular word processing tools in the world, and the number of parts of Microsoft Word has only expanded over time. Word is available for installation on a particular computer or for use in the cloud on Microsoft servers through its Office 365 brand. Either way, the parts of Microsoft Word include features for entering and formatting text, tools to embed image, and files from other programs, the ability to save and print documents, and tools for collaborating with other users. Microsoft Word is a word processor developed by Microsoft. It was first released on October 25, 1983 under the name Multi-Tool Word for Xenix Systems. Subsequent versions were later written for several other platforms, including IBM PC, Running DOS, 1983, Apple Macintosh, running the classic Mac OS during 1985, AT&T Unix PC during 1985, Atari EST during 1988, OS2 during 1989, Microsoft Windows during 1989, SEO Unix during 1994, and Mac OS formerly OS X during 2001. Commercial versions of Word are licensed as a standalone product or as a component of Microsoft Office. Windows RT or the discontinued Microsoft Word Suite. Microsoft Word or MS Word, often called Word, is a graphical word processing program that users can type with it is made by the computer company Microsoft. Its purpose is to allow users to type and save documents. Similar to other word processor, it has helpful tools to make documents such as spelling and grammar checker, word count, this also counts letters and lines, speech recognition, inserts figures and documents, choice of type paces, special codes, web pages, graphs, and so on, tables, display synonyms of words and can read out the text, and prints in different ways. Microsoft Word is a part of Microsoft Office, but can also be bought separately. On the next slide, there are some interfaces of Microsoft Word. Microsoft Word is a complex program used by people for a variety of functions, including business people writing memos and reports, students taking notes in class, home users writing informal or formal correspondence, and people designing flyers and banners to promote events. Word has features designed for each of these types of users. Current versions of the software also include collaboration features designed to make it easy for multiple users to share documents and work on them together. The following slides are the meaning of every part of English explain their uses when creating documents. The parts of the Microsoft Word are Quick Access Toolbar, Title Bar, Ribbon, Vertical Scroll Bar, Horizontal Scroll Bar, Zoom Control, View Shortcut, Status Bar, Ruler, Insertion Point, and Document Window. The Quick Access Toolbar is a collection of buttons that provide one-click access to commonly used commands such as Save, Undo, or Redo. You can also customize this according to your preference. Next, the Title Bar. It's a bar that displays the name of active document. Ribbon. It is the main set of commands and controls organized tasks in tabs and groups. You can also customize the ribbon according to your preference. Vertical scroll bar. Scroll bar to use when you want to scroll vertically through the document window. Horizontal scroll bar. 
scroll bar to use when you want to scroll horizontally through the document window. Zoom control. Used for magnifying and shrinking of the active document. New shortcut. Buttons used to change how the worksheet content is displayed. Print layout, full screen reading, web layout, outline, or drop. Status bar. It displays information about your document such as what page you are currently viewing and how many words are in your document, and so on. Ruler. It is used to set the alignment and margins of the elements in the documents. Insertion point. It is the blinking vertical line in your document. It indicates where you can enter text on the page. You can use the insertion point in a variety of ways. Black document. When a new blank document opens, the insertion point is located in the top learner cor left corner of the page. Document window, the white space where you can type or attach all the data you need in the document. Additional parts and functions of the Microsoft Word are Office button or file menu, Home tab, Insert tab, Design tab, Page Layout tab, References tab, Mailings tab, Review tab, View tab, Help tab, Minimize button, Maximize button, and Close button. Office button or file menu is in MS Word 2000 and file tab for MS Word 2010 or higher version. It provides access to document level features and program settings. Home. This is the tab that has almost everything you need when completing a Word document. You can change your font, font size, paragraph orientation, add bullets, and so on. Insert. The Insert tab allows users to add a table, clip art, or chart to a document. Anything that is an additional graphic insert will most likely be found here. Design. The Design tab consists of groups of commands that you can use to create, modify, manipulate, dimension, and analyze Word document. Page Layout. The Page Layout tab provides options for page orientation, size columns, borders, page color, and so on. References. Add an index or bibliography page here. Mailings. Create address labels and type for envelopes. Review. Review your document before you print it. Check, spell check and the thesaurus for help. View. View your document at 50 or 150% or in different layouts. Help. You can also forego either the type a question box or the office assistant and get your help directly from the help window. To directly access the help window, select help and then the help command for the application you are using, such as Microsoft Word Help. You can also press the F1 key to make the help window appear. Minimize button. The minimize button makes the window disappear from the screen without closing the program. You can bring the window back by clicking on its button on the taskbar at the bottom of the screen. Maximize button. The maximize button makes the window smaller or takes it back to full size. And last part and function of the Microsoft Word, close button. The close button closes the document or program. So that's all the learnings about the parts and functions of a Microsoft Word. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.